Hello, today we're going to work on lesson 26 and we are going to first measure the parameter of each shape in centimeters. So, let's look at number one. Each side is four centimeters, so we need to write four plus four plus four. This triangle has three equal sides, so it is all four centimeters. Four plus four is eight, and eight plus four is twelve. So twelve is the answer for number one. Let's look at number three. For number three, it doesn't say it doesn't show all the lengths of each side, however, this side and this side are equal, and the top side and the bottom sides are equal, so this is also 4 centimeters, and the bottom side is also 6 centimeters, so 6 plus 4 plus 6 plus 4. 6 plus 4 is 10. And again, 6 plus 4 is 10. And then, now if you add two tens, then it is 20. So 20 is the answer for number 3. Let's look at number 4. For this shape, it has five equal sides so it is pentagon and if it has five equal sides then all of them are five centimeters and five centimeters so we need to add all of these sides five plus five plus five plus 5 plus 5 5 plus 5 is 10 10 plus 5 is 15 and 15 plus 5 is 20 and um 20 plus 5 is 25 so 25 is the answer for number 4. Let's move on to the next page. For this part, we have chart, and we need to write the total by counting the t tally marks. Then use the tally chart to complete the bar graph. Let's look at the total of the dog. So each of these are equal to 5, and for this one it has 1, 2, 3, so 5 plus 5 plus 3 equals to the total. First 5 plus 5 is 10, and 10 plus 3 is 13, so the total amount of dogs are 13. Let's look at the total of rabbit. So there are two of these which are fives. So it is 5 plus 5 and 5 plus 5 is 10. So there are 10 total of rabbit to get the cats again it has two fives which is 10 and then we need to add one more which becomes 11 and lastly bear has 5 plus 2 which is 7 so there are seven in total.
Now we need to graph these numbers. First, we need to graph the total amount of dogs. So it is 13. And if we count this, 13 is over here. So this graph needs to be until here. And then now we need to graph the cat. Let's try graphing the cat and there are 11 to in total so we need to write 11 over here. about here so we need to graph this until it reaches the height of 11 so these are the graphs of dogs and cats let's move on to the next page For this part, we need to have the coins to find the total. So, let's look at number one. This is half dollar, and half dollar is 50 cents. Quarter dollar is 25 cents, and this one is also same as half dollar so it is 50 cents and this one says quarter dollar which is 25 cents so now we need to add all these first 50 plus 50 is 100 and 25 plus 25 becomes 5 plus 5 is 10 and 2 plus 1 is 3, and 3 plus 2 is 50. So now we need to do 100 plus 50, which becomes 150. And if we change it to dollars, then it's $1.50. And Let's move on to the next page. For this part, we have word problems. Let's look at number one. David brings donuts to give out to his classmates on his birthday. He brings 13 chocolate donuts, 9 strawberry donuts, and some powdered donuts. If David has 34 classmates, how many powdered donuts did he bring? So we need to first add 13 and 9, which is... twenty-two. Now we need to subtract 22 from 34, which is 12. So 12 is the answer for number one. Thank you.